geniuses. Thank you very much, Pastry Time. First off, congratulations on your win. A little applause here for EG, guys. Yeah. Very happy players here, of course, obviously, uh, Snoopy. I mean, winning here, that's maybe something that a lot of people had predicted, but were you surprised that you took it a 3-0 sweep? Yeah, for sure. Like, coming into this last two, two three weeks, we've been in uh, the States for three weeks now. We've been practicing a lot. Um, but the first, the last three weeks, and not counting last night, we lost pretty much all scrims. We were doing so bad in practice. Um, and it wasn't until last night with a couple of scrims, we won like all of our scrims last night and it gave us like a new sense of confidence coming into today. The last three weeks, I was genuinely worried that we weren't gonna make it. Um, and everyone like on, there was some Reddit threads predicting we might not because TBD was so strong. And they are the really good players, like commend them guys. Give them a round of applause for TBD. <laughs> or GTG, whatever it is. The turn gaming. Of course, in the first game, they kind of put up a fight, but it seemed like you guys just got rolling. Tell me a little bit about that new synergy you had to find, letting go of two players that you played with for so long and getting two new ones. Yeah, well, it's been a, it was a conscious thing for the last uh, year. Like, I always wanted to go to America, um, and now I just I wanted to make it happen. And Frog and Wicked, they wanted to stay back in Europe. They have family back there. Like, they love the EU LCS and things like that. They want to stay in Europe. So that's, that just had to be. Like, we, us three guys here moved to the States, picked up Inox and Paul Beller, and they're great, they're great players. <laughs> <You're> chasing me. <laughs> yeah, um, well, very good to see you guys doing good, here as well, doing good here as well. Of course, this is only just the first hurdle. You have the entire NALCS season now. What do you think realistically is your goal there, and what success can you get? I think judging on the past three weeks being very, very shaky, I'm not going to set my sights too high right now. Initially, we're going to take each day as it comes, each week as it comes at the moment. Um, Last, the, today was promising, he's chasing me around still. Yeah. Today was promising, but uh, we need to take each day as it comes and each week as it comes, starting on January 17th. Uh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> um, but now, is there anything you want to say to your fans? Because it seems like you've gone across the Atlantic, but all your fans are still here. A <laughs> uh, Scottish comrade down there. Nice. Uh, <laughs> Um, no, thanks very much guys for supporting us. I know it's sad we split up, like we're no longer the Fryzy or CLG or whatever it is, but uh, thanks very much for continuing to support us. Support the guys out in Europe as well, Frog and Wicked, and support our new team as well here in NA. Um, we'll try and do you proud. Well, congratulations once again. Fantastic performance. Good luck in the NA LCS. And now for more on the Evil Genius' impressive three-game sweep, let's send it over to Riv, Freak, and Crumbs at the Analyst Desk.